Okay, uh, for this day, or this beat, I'm gonna try uh, easy drum solo. It's page 17 of the book that I've been learning from, Drumming the Easy Way, by Tom Hapke. Um, I mean, I can try to, you know, scan the music and put it up for you. I really don't have time to explain every measure, but basically, in this solo, you play a groove twice, you kind of change it up a little, uh, you, you play a permutation of that groove, and then you go into a fill. And so the first two measures are just bass on the one and the three, snare on the two and the four, the easy speed, the, the first one I went over. And then the third measure is just you add a bass drum on the end of three, and then you have a one bar, one measure fill. And then you go into a different beat that uh, permutates per measure, actually. And then you go into a two measure fill. And this two measure fill is actually, it was very difficult for me to learn and memorize because, I don't know, it's just an unusual thing. And it's kind of hard to keep your timing for a two measure fill, especially if you're not having a click track guide you. Uh, then you go into two more measures of groove, but then you end on a fill. Okay, so again, I can't explain every note to you like I, I normally explain beat of the days um, because this is a little more material, but you can either buy the book, Drumming the Easy Way, or uh, request the sheet music and I can scan it and put it up. Uh, I hope that's not plagiarism. I mean, but, you know, I'm sure they wouldn't mind if somebody demonstrates the solo and shows an interpretation of it. All right. Here it goes.